that's not roasting. Jack Frost nipping at your nose. Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today is day, I think day four. No, day two or day three of me doing this vlogmas. Um, today we will be talking about Christmas wish list. As you can see, I have my book here because I took some notes on what I wanted for Christmas. And to be honest, we're going to call this the semi-realistic Christmas list because some of these items, you know, they are a little pricey. And, you know, we are going through a lot with the economy and everything. So I am very considerate. Um, if any of my family members are watching, take notes, you know, and if you have any questions, you have my number. So let's get on with the video. So for the first thing that I want for Christmas, and this is the, this is the pricey item. This is the one. Anyway, like I was saying, um, this item, the first item is kind of pricey. Um, but it's an item that will be a really good investment for me, especially with me doing content creation. And that is an iPad Pro or an iPad Air. One of the two. Um, I really want a regular size iPad. That's why I don't have the iPad Mini up here. And I've been seeing a lot of girls use the iPad to create their like thumbnails and things because like I do mine either on my phone or on my laptop and sometimes it can get annoying with my phone or sometimes it can get annoying with my laptop so to have the iPad and use like the pencil and everything and be able to create the thumbnails as well as um edit and diff different things like that and be more precise because I have like the pen and stuff it will really help me you know um, it will also help me like you know when I have like notes and things that I want to write down or when I have like my content planner to have an iPad just so I can have like it with me but anyway you know that's that's the first thing on my list that I would really love for Christmas um, the second thing is the Steve Madden possession sneakers to me these are the sneakers of the fall season like tan and black and white those are like the only do y'all not see me in tan right now? Like, those are the only colors I wear, pretty much. So, being able to have those sneakers, those were literally, bleh, literally, second to my Air Force Ones, become, like, my go-to sneakers. They're $100 at Steve Madden. I absolutely love those sneakers. I am a size um, 10, just for reference. Um, well, 9.5 to a 10, depending on the cut of the shoe. Um... So I would really love these sneakers. Um, the third item on my wish list would be gift cards. And gift cards is just like so I can get like certain makeup items. Um, I know when it comes to like certain family members, they're not good at, um, I don't want to say shopping online, but like when it comes to like certain brands, they're not really, they don't really know them. Like they know Ulta, they know Sephora, but if I tell them like I want, this particular brand from this store this particular item they would just prefer just to give me the gift card and just let me get it so I will accept gift cards I also like Amazon gift cards because I can rack up some stuff at Amazon so that's also another item um fourth item this is once again another um pricey pretty pricey a pretty penny for and it's a Canada Goose jacket. I have a picture over here of the exact jacket that I want. Um, yeah, I plan to really travel next year. Um, and that does include, I really want to try going to Vancouver and also Montreal. Um, and I do want to go back to Toronto. And I think all three of those places snow. So, and then plus I live in New Jersey. So, it snows up there as well. And then I... You know go back and forth to new york so yeah it snows there as well so i just feel like canada goose would just be like the perfect jacket to have with all the snow in my opinion and plus it's canada goose like i don't know i just it's cute it's cute in my opinion and i want the jacket so that's why i put it on my christmas list as well as since i do plan to go to vancouver i do plan to go to Montreal, and i do plan to go to toronto I feel like, duh, Canada Goose. But, um, anyway. 
the last item on my list, because I only did five, you know, just keep it nice, simple, and sweet, um, is the Morphe and Ariel brush set. So the Morphe and Ariel collaboration they did with the brush sets. To me, these brushes are beautiful. I've seen multiple makeup um, beauty content creators and makeup artists use them. And I just feel like it's time that I add some new brushes to my collection. I've been using the same brushes for, I would say, at least two years. I'll say at least two years. I've had them for at least two years. Some brushes are, like, brand new that I bought, like, single. Like, you know, Morphe, you can buy the brushes single individually. Um, but I just really love these brushes. I feel like they're so cute. And I just want them to my... I want to add them to my collection. I just feel like they're very, like neutral and just I've heard that they're really good when it comes to like products especially when it comes to like the eye sets and stuff so yeah I really want that these are a hundred dollars I think so yes so that is the end of my Christmas list like I said I just kept it really short and sweet and to the point of the main things that I did want this Christmas um like I said if you are a family member and you're watching this Hey, how you doing? Um, you know, you have my number if you have any questions. And I can send you the links to all of the items I had on here. Um, so, yeah. These are the items that I want. And, I don't know, maybe if I, you know, get myself together, I can invest in a couple of these items myself if I need to. But, um, yeah. So, this is the end of the Vlogmas Day 3. I think I said or day two one of the two either day two or day three um depends on how I schedule these things but um thank you for watching make sure you like comment and subscribe and I will see you tomorrow tomorrow so I'm